and I was just thinking uh, linguistic is the study of language and uh, we got a cool way with words, a unique way with words and civilians, just regular everyday people that just out there working, trying to get by and doing what they love. So Day one, I felt like a family. It is a family. I don't feel like the only girl. Like, you know, as they say so much, like I really don't feel like the only girl. If anything, I feel more like one of the guys. It's been nice though, because you know, you do you do so many shows trying to get your name out there and then open up to someone like the far side and then have them watching your set and coming up to you afterwards saying how much they enjoyed it and it just yeah. It, it's very humbling. It makes all the difference in the world for me, just being such a fan of these people for years and years. And, you know, we were all so busy outside of doing this, but this is like why we do everything else. But it's tough to coordinate all the schedules. Yeah, I play uh, semi-pro football for the Vermont High School in my first year. Um, kind of like. Living out a dream, and I wouldn't call it so much a bucket list, but it, it, would, <laughs> it would qualify, you know. The only time that we could get together was 1 a.m. to 3 a.m. It was the only time we could get together and practice. And it kind of has, after doing so many shows, we kind of don't practice unless we're, even when we have new songs, we kind of just debut them on stage and just, this is how it's going to get. Oh, that sounds pretty good. So it's kind of, uh, unfortunately, it's to the point now where everyone's so busy. Like, we need to connect with the audience. We need to make them see that you're having a great time, you know. When there's just a live crowd, like the room is packed, you can feel that. It's like, it's like opening a door and then there's a fire inside, you know. You feel it and you're like, whoa, you know, and then you get up and that's what, that's what our shows are all about, you know what I mean? We can, we can get moms years. dancing, we're good, you know? Right. We get a lot of, after our shows, we get a lot of, well, I don't like hip-hop, but you guys are awesome, you know? Like, <laughs> we I like, like you guys. Yeah, <laughs> I don't like rap, but you guys are phenomenal. Well, you just didn't know good, good, good rap, you know? You didn't know good hip-hop or what hip-hop is, you know? Right. We love the party, we love the fans, we love what we're doing. We're just here to express ourselves and have a great time, so that's all I got for them. Sometimes I don't like, I catch myself like, yeah, this is real and it's fun. And I almost gave up on it. You know, like I was like, cause I, you know, me, I mean, I'm 36. I, there's rappers that are like approaching 50. So I'm like, wait a minute, why would I want to quit? So, but I had a reason to continue in this linguistic surveillance. So, and they, they kept my spirit alive. And it's, Four years strong, and we haven't stopped yet, so.